Right then, so finally we've reached Sunday. The first week ends from the lockdown being lifted. And like I've already told you, during the lockdown, like two of the dishes which I was missing the most during the lockdown was steaks as well as grilled fish and lemon butter sauce. So I think the week is not going to be complete if, unless I try these items. So I think I'll quickly head over to Park Street at one of my favorite restaurants and see what is available from the continental section. It is raining, but I left myself with no other choice since I waited till the last day. So let's see how things go. Since the food hub of Park Street is somewhat like seven to eight minutes away from where I stay, I almost always invariably decide to walk down and that is something which I'm doing today as well. It's, it's less of a challenge now since there is hardly any transport uh, nearby and uh, the only challenge right now seems to be the drizzle which is happening but that was by no ways going to discourage or deter me from not coming out of the house so yes let's see. Alright so I've almost reached the center of Park Street where all the major food hubs are. I like calling it the big four. There is Macambo, there's Marco Polo, there's Barbecue and there is Peter Cat. Of course there are a lot of other restaurants too. Now I'm kind of spoiled for choice right now as to which restaurant to visit. So I think today is going to be my choice as to what I do. But definitely I'd like to hear from you in the comment section if you'd like me to try out any other restaurant in the coming few weeks. So today's destination is going to be Mocambo. Let's start with the first restaurant which comes on my way. The history of this place you already know. This is what the facade of the place looks like. They are taking their necessary precautions with the shield and the face mask and everything else. So I think we're going to go through all the necessary precaution steps which they are taking. So without further ado, let me... Chika. The first step is sanitizing your hand here. And you do this. Next up, temperature check. So I'm good to go. It doesn't end here. They also have a sanitizing of your feet. Is it done? Thank you. This is what the restaurant looks like. Greeted by the manager, everyone is wearing the face shield, hand gloves and masks. I don't think there's room for any doubts. Good to go? Thank you. All right, so I am settled at a table or we are inside the Mocambo. This is the menu which they have, which is disposable. So they've done away with their regular menu and this is gonna be changed every time uh, the guests are done at a table. So this is the menu. You can see it directly from here. I started with ordering my customary fresh lime soda. For mains, I was looking for grilled fish or something of lamb, but since I did not get an option of my choice, I am going with, what am I going with? I'm going with a portion of chicken a la kiev, a filling of chicken stuffed with butter. Our Russian's favorite. Restaurants have been scattered over here, so they're using only 50% capacity. As you can see, every alternate table, like the one in front of me, this is, uh, the cover is cleared. So only 50% capacity is there and they're maintaining social distancing like this. like once it's open all right so i am done with my lunch midway through the lunch we get this news about um, the suicide of shashant singh rajput it's very shocking and so much so that i couldn't finish my lunch actually but i still would uh, try to bring you guys um, a, uh, an interaction with a manager or someone 
who has authority over you to show you or speak to you about what are the necessary precautions they are taking. So you can stay tuned for that. I'll try to get that arranged if possible. A thermal check on them. Okay. We're sanitizing them. We're taking a thermal check on them, and then we are sanitizing the Those footwear. Also. Footwear also. All right. We have the mat for that, and we are sanitizing them. All right. When the guests come, we are maintaining a social distancing. We are keeping tables apart. The guys who are serving, mm -hmm. they are also wearing masks, the shield and, and the shield gloves. And gloves and they are sanitized every two hours. Every two hours? Every two hours and they just don't serve the food between this. Yes, that's also something I noticed. It was not served that it was yes. placed on the table. Placed on the table.